I made the biggest mistake in Genshin Impact. So if you guys have played Genshin Impact, you would know that summoning for both the character you want as well as the weapon you want would require many, and I mean many, pulls. Unless you have some pretty great luck within the gacha system, it takes a while for you to obtain all the prime gems necessary to wish for those characters and the banners and the weapons and the banners. You also have to beat the odd on both banners to obtain the items that you want. A 50-50 odd, in fact. So, for Nivellet's banner, I wanted to get one copy of Nivellet and one copy of the weapon. I did not really expect to get the weapon, but the character, I knew I was guaranteed. So, I pulled and I pulled, and I finally obtained Nivellet. I was really excited to finally build a character that everyone has been going crazy about. That everyone was really excited and crazy about. And I was finally excited to get to use the Hydro Pump. Yeah, that's pretty much the only reason I wanted to get Nibelet was because I wanted to have Blastoise on my account. Alright, it, it's is it that bad? I just wanted to have Blastoise. I'm a Pokemon fan. <clears throat> anyway, then I decided to do the unthinkable and I went for his weapon. This was a really special moment because I was at a 50-50 to get the weapon and I'm not guaranteed on the weapon banner here. So I went in and I pulled one pull after another. I was using the multis. I was clenching my fist and then the five star came unlocked. And there it was. I was relieved to see the five star I was going for the tome eternal flow here on my screen this weapon looks absolutely insane leveled up and at zero levels it looks so cool in fact i think it is one of the most insane looking and most good looking five star catalysts to date it just looks so well detailed the cool little light at the top of the book the Noma or Ouija or whatever it's called it's just so nice to pair and I was so excited to have it on my Nivellet and it makes him really really powerful then something else occurred something so unexpected that I thought I was a little crazy I didn't want to pull on the character banner in case I accidentally pulled a banner character so I pulled on the weapon banner in hopes of obtaining a few stardust so I could use it to level up my new tome. Why you may ask, it's kind of silly, well you're pretty much right. But I wanted to pull on the banner because farming for some of the tome mats was really tedious and I was ready to just get it from the shop. So I had around 480 gems ready to go so that I should just get 45 stardust, right? So. I pulled once, I got 50, I pulled twice, I got 30, all good so far, then the last one took a turn. I clicked on the wish banner, I clicked on skip, and there it was, greeting me with the 5 star look. It had all 5 stars on the bottom, I heard the little star sound that it made, another tome of eternal water. I was in shock. I had no words to mutter at that moment. All time went still and I just felt a rush of emotions as I yelled screaming. Maybe even sobbing. It was definitely unexpected and well a free 5 star. Though it would have been nice if I would have gotten the other 5 star weapon just to have or use on another character like Kuki perhaps. That was that. And that is the story of how I made the biggest mistake in Genshin Impact. Wish without purpose. If I got those three wishes back to pull on another 5 star weapon, or maybe Arlecchino, that would have been an insane moment and would have been more work. If I had those gems back, I would definitely make another decision. I just really wanted those stardust. I wanted to use it to get the mats. I'm just farming for those mats were just so tedious that I had to make a different choice. I just wanted to get it over with, go to the shop, get some, or use some stardust, and it would have been over. I didn't need to use the stardust for anything else, right? Um, I didn't need to wish on an, a character. I won't wish for a character in a while. So I didn't really think it's necessary to obtain the 
the polls on those, you know, it's fine. Now, that is pretty much all I wanted to talk about in this video. I know it's a little bit short, but that, and I just wanted to talk about this little incident that happened. But yeah, if you like this video and you want some more content like this, click on the banner on the top right of the screen here to lead you to another video similar to this, as well as subscribe to the channel and stay up to date on Genshin and Hoyoverse and Honkai Impact and gaming related things. Thank you so much for watching, hope you enjoyed.